Five, four, Do it. three, two, two, Do it. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Arlie, and I'm here with another video. Okay, so let's talk about procrastination and my struggle with procrastination. Pro procrastination. I don't know how to say it the right way. But the one thing I want to say, man, is if you have this preconceived notion of what the truth is versus what it actually is, I don't know how you can solve that. I don't know. Here's my thing. I solved it by just not worrying about it. Not worry about what's gonna happen if I do this and do that. Some of you won't even go get your car brakes fixed just because you care what somebody else has to say about the f the way your fucking car looks. If you have a trashy looking car, you're the type of person. Some of you are the type of person. Not all of you. Some of you are the type of people who would not go get your car fixed just because it looks trashy, and you'd rather go spend money to get your car looking good than pay for the brakes. The shit that actually that you actually need your car for it to function. That is the state of mind we got out here now, okay? It is time, high time that people stop caring what people think. You know, it's like this, you know, it's, it's dudes out there, they're like, I can't get a girl. All I did was say she's pretty and said, I, you know, I would like to meet up with her. Dude, you can't do that. You just met her, okay? Come on. If you want a decent woman, you gotta do it right. I'm not gonna say no names who it was, but look, all I'm trying to say is a lot of you care too much about what people think. And that leads to procrastination. It does. And some of you care more about failure than actually doing something. Okay? Don't procrastinate, okay? You don't know the result. I am I know this. Look, I I know how it feels. I did it with YouTube for the longest. Now I can't even keep my hands off the upload button, okay? Even if a video does bad, guess what? I move on to the next one. I keep practicing. I keep getting better. That's how you do it. Same thing with everything in your life. You have to just take a shot, okay? Some of y'all got shit you gotta fix. Hell, I got shit I gotta fix. Everybody's got shit I gotta fix. Look, man, y'all want me to tell y'all what I need to fix? For real. I don't care what people think of me anyway. For real. You know what I need to fix? Oh, shit, the game froze. Oh, there we go, there we go. It's going again. It's going. It's going. But yeah, y'all know what I need to fix, man? Bro, I'm not even embarrassed to say this. I need to learn how to be a better friend. I need to learn how to like take some time and not be busy all the time. Like actually try and make an effort to have friendships. Cause I mess up my friendships with doing this YouTube stuff, man. I mess up my friendships sometimes doing this shit. I don't care. I mean, it, in a way, I kind of don't care because I'm willing to give that up. I'm one of those people that don't need friends. I like friends. But I, dude, if it gets in the way of something I really want to do, it's like one of those things like, uh, I think I regret it more if I don't actually do this thing. But like, I do feel like I can have friends and do what I want to do at the same time and two things I need to do without my friends or whatever I think is holding me back. I think that's ridiculous thinking. See, that's what I'm saying. I need to fix my mindset. And I'm, I'm not embarrassed to say it. I need to fix that mindset. I have this this preconceived notion in my head that if I hang out with friends to which I have any little bit of fun, I'm gonna fail in life. That's not a way to live, man. That's a, it's a bunch of A students living that way and I'm not having an A student. So I want you guys to talk about problems you have. If you come to another Twitch stream, be open and honest. We all have issues. I have issues. Look, I have issues. Look, in relationships, I have another issue. And let's be honest. I'm going to be completely honest with myself. When there's a problem, I try my best not to avoid it instead of trying to help the person or be supportive. Okay? Something you got to work on. It ain't easy. Everybody makes mistakes. It ain't perfect. But all of y'all, like, oh, it's got to be perfect. Or if it's any kind of bad, 
I can't do it. No, you can't make progress that way. You have to fail, okay? You have you have to take a leap. Stop just stop trying to be perfect. Stop trying to be perfect. You can't be perfect, okay? It's impossible. That's all I got to say, man. That's really all I got to say about procrastination. That's it. Dang, where is the crimes at? I want a crime, man. What y'all got going on? I ain't do all the crimes that quick. I know I didn't. Oh, here we go. That's what I'm talking about right there. Boom. Boom. That's it. There we go, baby. Oh, it's getting real. Oh! Wee! That's how you knock people out. Hammerhead guys, hammerhead guys get tied with their formal wear? Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> Messing up my combos, man. I'm done. Dude, are you serious? Gotcha. Ooh! Ooh! What now? It? Sorry, I got Look, guys, you gotta stop caring about what people think. I don't care. Bro, stop caring about what people think, okay? I used to have this problem too. I used to care so much about what people thought of me. I don't give a damn no more, dude. You gotta stop that shit, bro. That's kid stuff. Come on, man. You're a grown adult. You gotta care about your well-being. You don't have time to care about what other people got in their head going on. They gonna think 24-7. Guess what? You think 24-7. You ain't got time for that, dude. Oh, God. This guy is taking off. You ain't got time for that, man. Think about it for a minute. You really don't have time. Think about all the stuff you got going on. You probably got some bills going on. Probably got school, and you over here work, taking time out of your day to work. Worry about your homework tonight. Worry about your work shift tonight, making it on time. Okay? Stop caring about what people goddamn think. Are they paying your bills? I don't give a fuck. Some of you say I'm a failure. I'm a failure. Stop that self pity, bitch. Okay? Stop the self pity. Whatever's going on, man. Stop it. Okay? Now, I understand depression is a huge deal. I'm not making fun of depression. Let me put that out there. I'm not making fun of depression. But what I'm saying is, find a way to get out of that depressive state. Maybe you can get help, professional help. But what I'm trying to say is, don't let anxiety, procrastination, keep you from doing something great, being who you want to be, okay? You've got to find that, that, that drive to keep going, to make things happen. And you got to find that drive in you. And it's not about success. People want to say money. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about like just being free and feeling good. Because you can have success and not feel good about yourself or be right in the head. You know what I mean? Focus on your mental and your physical health. Fuck how much money you got. Fuck what other people think. You worry about yourself. You don't have the capacity to worry about other people. Okay? Until you get there. Until you get to that point. Once you get to that point, then it's a, ain't no wrong with giving a fuck. But right now, it's kind of like insane to do that. Especially the way the world is. And a lot of the stuff that we worry about is artificial shit that was created by humanity. Worry about yourself and worry about your health. Don't let toxic people dictate your life and say, oh, this is going to happen. This is going to be what it is. You got If someone says this to you, oh, you got to do something with your life. Most of the time, they hate you. OK? 
okay? Now, if it's something crazy, like you on drugs or something, like that's different. They have genuine concern for me. That, that, that is different. I mean, other than that, if it ain't something that's like deteriorating your health, stop listening to what people got to say about you. People tell me, why are you still doing YouTube? You don't have a million subscribers. You know, the first thing I'm thinking in my mind is like, bitch, I gotta get there first, don't I? That's what I'm saying. And then that's where everything that they thinking about, or what you think they know, or whatever they got to say, goes out the window. Because most of the time, when they say shit like that, okay, where are you? Are you somewhere? Another person with the same amount of subscribers or more ain't gonna say some shit like that to you because they understand how. Or, if it's anything else, whether it's like, oh, why are you going to school for that? You sure that's going to get you a high paying job? Well then, hey, what if I really like doing this? What if I don't give a fuck about how much money I'm going to get paid? What if I genuinely like it? That's where you stay in your lane. Everybody's got to stay in their lane, bro. Stay in your lane, dude. And for the love of God, stop buying shit to impress people. Bro, drive a beat up hunt. You know what, dude? I don't care if you got a good amount of money. If you can get bullied having a car, don't have a car. Some of you are going to be like, you're crazy, my city. It depends on your circumstance, but stay, you don't need a car. You don't need this. You don't need that. You don't need to go out with friends to prove. You don't need to go out and spend money with friends to prove that you you, you about something. Everybody want to get lit and go spend money because they friends do it. Okay, but... Is that helping you? You gotta think about what's benefiting you. You gotta make sure you're benefiting you. You can't, you can't just do stuff to impress people. You gotta do it for you. If you go out and get you a beer, you went out and got a beer because you wanted to. Not because... Look, man. I'm getting into some dangerous territory because people like to listen to their parents, their cousins, people that have nothing to fucking do with their life goals or stuff that they want to do. Hi, David. And Hi, David. I'm, one of the hideouts. I'm, one of the hideouts. I'm getting into some dangerous territory. Probably should stop talking while I'm ahead, but it's very toxic for you to like listen to people when you're passionate about something. And especially if they didn't even do it. If they never experienced that, or if they've never talked about what you're passionate about, or if they didn't have the same passion. Now, to a certain extent, I can understand someone who had the same passion as you and they failed at it. And then they tell you, like, don't do that. Because there's that fear. They, to, they have that, the that fear that it will happen to you, too, just like it happened to them. Understandable. Still don't listen to them, either. What I'm trying to say is you got to follow your passion. Well, it's not even just that. You don't even have to necessarily follow straight to your passion. Okay, if you need to make sure you got some money first, good. Go get you a job. Stop caring about what people think. Do what needs to be done, okay? Okay, you know the odds against you. Figure it out. Stop caring about what people think, man. What the? What the? Like for real. Don't be clean. You won't be clean. You won't be clean. You won't be clean. Oh, dang. The stuff is crazy. Ooh. Very soon. Very soon. Ooh. That was a nice combo. Let's try to keep her. There we go. Get away from me. That's how you saw oh, yeah. all your problems. I was just wondering. I was just wondering. How much do you know about? How much do you know about Sable Tone Country, Sincaria? Oh! Oh! Oh, let's get this combo, boys. Wow, that is insane. 
I'm curious. I'm curious. You guys get food delivered. You guys get food delivered. Drop it down the drain or what? Oh! Let's finish this. Who is that? Really? Bye. Get him. Damn. What the? Huh? Messed up my streak. Oh, that guy almost got me. Let's get him. Ooh. You gotta like have a good sense of using your gadgets at the same time and go. Gotcha. Stop doing that. Humanitarian supply, humanitarian supply should be around here somewhere.
why we play Fortnite.